A warm welcome to you, dear audience, on this inspiring journey through the realm of the abstract and the profound. Today, we embark on an exploration that transcends the boundaries of ordinary thought, diving deep into the heart of mathematical logic and its intriguing paradoxes. We are stepping into the world of Kurt Gödel and his groundbreaking incompleteness theorems, a place where the beauty of numbers dances with the subtlety of philosophy, creating a mesmerizing ballet of intellectual rigor and philosophical profundity. At the heart of our exploration today lies a question as intriguing as it is paradoxical. Can the foundations of mathematics be complete, consistent, and decidable all at the same time? This question, ladies and gentlemen, forms the core of our philosophical journey today. Gödel's incompleteness theorems are the tragic heroes of mathematical logic, painting a picture of inherent limitations within the discipline. The first incompleteness theorem states that no consistent system of axioms whose theorems can be listed by an effective procedure is capable of proving all truths about the arithmetic of the natural numbers. It implies that there are always truths that are unreachable within any given system. The second incompleteness theorem goes a step further, asserting that no consistent system can prove its own consistency, presenting a self-reflexive paradox of mathematical logic. The implications of Gödel's theorems are profound, placing inherent limitations on the pursuit of complete knowledge. They challenge us to reimagine the very nature of truth, proof, and knowledge, compelling us to acknowledge the existence of unprovable truths within any given system. These theories have been echoed and amplified by numerous thinkers across the ages. Bertrand Russell, the eminent British philosopher and logician, grappled with similar issues in his Principia Mathematica, attempting to establish a secure foundation for mathematics. His efforts, while monumental, were ultimately proven to be insufficient by Gödel's theorems. Contemporary philosopher Roger Penrose has also engaged deeply with Gödel's work. He extrapolates Gödel's theorems to argue against the possibility of strong AI, the idea that machines can fully replicate human thought. According to Penrose, Gödel's theorems indicate that human intuition and understanding go beyond the algorithmic. Culturally, Gödel's theorems have found their way into literature and film. Jorge Luis Borges' short story, The Library of Babel, mirrors Gödel's ideas, presenting a universe of books filled with every possible combination of letters, and yet many truths remain elusive and unprovable. In film, Christopher Nolan's Inception can be seen as a metaphor for the self-referential paradoxes highlighted by Gödel. In contemporary discussions, Gödel's theorems often spark debate about the fundamental nature of reality. Some argue they prove the existence of mathematical truths that are inherently unknowable, while others contend they simply highlight the limitations of formal systems. Regardless, Gödel's theorems continue to challenge our preconceived notions about truth and knowledge. Understanding Gödel's incompleteness theorems is of paramount importance for anyone interested in the philosophy of mathematics, logic, or artificial intelligence. They serve as a humbling reminder of the limitations of formal systems and by extension, the limits of human comprehension. In the grand ballet of numbers and logic, Gödel's theorems stand as poignant reminders of the dance's inherent mystery. They invite us into a world where every truth has its shadow, every theorem its unprovable counterpart, and every system its inherent limitations. I wish to express my gratitude to all of you for joining us in this exploration into the heart of mathematical logic. Your engagement and intellectual curiosity have been instrumental in making this journey possible. As we conclude, I invite you to ponder on some profound questions. What does the existence of unprovable truths imply about our understanding of reality? How do we reconcile with the inherent limitations of our knowledge systems? What other aspects of life might reflect the paradoxes highlighted by Gödel's theorems? I look forward to having you with us in our next philosophical journey, where we continue to explore the intriguing intersection of thought, reality, and beyond. Until then, 
May you find joy in the dance of numbers, wisdom in the subtlety of paradoxes, and inspiration in the mystery of the unprovable.